Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mary. In today's video, I want to talk about all of my skincare and hair care favorites from 2021. So let's get started. I've already made detailed reviews for all of these products, so I'll leave the link in the description box below. The first product I want to talk about is face wash and my absolute favorite is the Requil Oil Control Face Wash. I really enjoyed using this face wash that this not only cleanses the face but also gives a lot of added benefits. It also helps in healing up of acne and preventing any sort of future breakouts so i really enjoyed using it also contains zinc pca in this face wash which is very beneficial for acne prone skin so if you have oily acne prone skin you would really enjoy this these days exfoliating face washes are very popular in the market and for exfoliating face wash i wanted to make a separate favorite so i recommend the dermaco one percent salicylic acid face wash uh, this is something i tried just recently and i really enjoyed using it i really loved it it's a very powerful exfoliating face wash it get uh, in just two to three uses it got rid of all of my blackheads that i had on my nose since quite some time and of course it clears off very easily all sorts of whiteheads at the same time uh, it is also very gentle it is, doesn't you know become like extremely stripping on the skin so that is why i highly recommend this one okay since i mentioned a face wash for oily skin i wanted to recommend a hydrating face wash as well so i uh, really enjoyed using the b body wise hydrating cleanser this is also not fragrance free it does contain a moderate fragrance so while applying the face wash you could smell the fragrance but otherwise it's a very very nice and gentle cleanser dry skin people would love this it is very hydrating very creamy in texture another one of my favorite Moving on to moisturizers, my all-time favorite is the Plum Oil-Free Moisturizer and I love this so much. This is the fastest skincare product that I have emptied and I just couldn't stop using it because it is so good. It not only moisturizes the skin but it also contains a lot of good ingredients like niacinamide, squalene. Um, so this is a really good moisturizer. This is their fragrance pre variant. If you have oily acne prone skin then this is perfect. Since I mentioned a moisturizer for oily skin, I wanted to recommend one for dry skin as well. So I recommend the Bioderma Atoderm Cream. This is a very good cream. Uh, it is very um, like nice emollient cream. So it would be great for dry skin people. Even if you have sensitive skin, this would work really nicely because it is fragrance free as well. And, and most of Bioderma products are suitable for people with sensitive skin. Moving on to serums, uh, I want to talk about niacinamide serums and I qu uh, tried quite a few of them and my favorite is is the minimalist uh, I tried their 10% niacinamide serum it's really nice I was really blown away with the results of this serum and uh, it gave very good results and oily skin people would love this because it really helps in controlling sebum production it gives a nice glow on the skin and not just that it also cleared a lot of my blackheads that I when I was using this serum so I highly recommend this one it's quite affordable too and um, it's really worth the money a lot of people are looking out for one product to get rid of any kind of acne scars and dark spots. So I highly recommend the Dermaco 2% Alpha Arbutin Serum. This is a very very effective serum. It got rid of a lot of acne scars that I had and uh, the time I was using it I had a lot of scars left behind from acne and it cleared off all of those scars that I had. So this is a very effective actually Alpha Arbutin is meant for uh, pigmented and um, skin and to work on pigmentation and acne scars and this this is a very effective one this is fragrance free as well moving on to sunscreens i haven't tried a lot of sunscreen to be very honest uh, but the few that i have tried i recommend the bioderma photoderm sunscreen fragrance free doesn't leave any sort of white cast a very good texture very lightweight it doesn't feel like a very heavy mask on the face so i highly recommend this one but since this is a little bit on the expensive side so i wanted to recommend an affordable one too and the one that i tried is lactocalamine sunscreen this is very nice i was very very happy with the results i was very happy with this sunscreen if you have oily skin then this would work really well it doesn't like feel very heavy or greasy no white cast you just have to apply it properly and it really settles into the skin 
very nicely next i want to talk about spot treatment since i have acne prone skin i do try out a lot of products as spot treatment for acne breakouts and one of the product that is highly effective is the sebo gel it's a salicylic acid based gel it is very affordable it, and uh, it is good great product for beginner as well it wouldn't cause any sort of irritation any kind of side effects so all you have to do is just apply it as a spot treatment on the areas wherever you have the breakouts uh, use it for another uh, three to four days and you will definitely start seeing reduction and the acne would start healing uh, quickly with this gel it's a very effective salicylic acid gel I want to talk about all of the hair care products that are my favorite and let's begin with hair oil and my most favorite hair oil of all times is the bee body wise onion hair oil this just had me blown away with the results of this hair oil it is absolutely amazing when i started using it in just a very short period of time actually they write on their packaging that wait for two months to see results because but i could see results in just two to three times of using this hair oil talking about the texture is so lightweight it and but when she, once you apply it and you keep it on the hair it feels quite refreshing uh, and you feel very uh, nice and relaxed and another thing is because of its lightweight texture and all it's very easy to you know rinse it off with any sls free shampoo it works very nice it, a lot of uh, hair oils are very heavy and thick and greasy so sometimes it gets difficult to you know remove them off from the hair with sls free shampoo but there's no problem with this one it washes off very easily so it uh, that time when i started using it i was facing a lot of hair fall for some reason and it started reducing my hair fall in just two to three times of using it so i highly recommend this if you're looking for a hair hair oil to control hair fall then this is a very good one next is hair mask and the one that i love the most is the wish care rice water hair mask so the texture of this hair mask is very lightweight it works really nice for oily scalp and you know dry hair uh, it leaves the hair frizz free very soft and smooth so i highly recommend this one in shampoo i always recommend the plum olive and macadamia shampoo it's a little bit hydrating shampoo has a nice fragrance and i really like this one next i want to talk about uh, lip balm and lip tint so in lip balm i recommend the chrono care lip balm now i don't like other products from this brand but this lip balm is really nice this is a ceramide based lip balm so because of the presence of ceramides it, it really helps and you know heal of chapped lips so if you have like very dry and extremely chapped lips and that is like completely peeling off then give this lip balm a try it is really nice it helps in repairing of repairing all of that uh, chapped lips that you have and after uh, two to three days of use you would notice that it has repaired the lips completely and it not only gives that moisturization to the lips but it also heals and repairs any sort of damage to the lips so i really like this one a lot of lip mask when you use it gives you that uh, deep moisturization and treatment sort of mask but you can't use it during the day and you can't use them under the lipstick but this one you can use you can also use it under any matte or any sort of lipstick and it works really nicely i was so lip and cheek tint also were very popular these days and i tried a few brands and my favorite is the just her lip and cheek tint uh, this is supremely pigmented and this is matte it leaves the lips looking very matte so that is all from today's video i hope you found this video to be useful and if you did don't forget to hit the thumbs up button make sure you're subscribed for more such skincare reviews and recommendations and you'll find all of these videos in the description box below so that is all for today i'll see you guys in the next one bye